It's your boy Odin from host.promo. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to change the last Gitka message and any Gitka message super easy, okay? All we need to do is go into our Git repository. Let me go ahead and show you what our commits look like. If we type in git log, you can see our last three commits. And we're gonna go ahead and change the last one that says added bash script. In order to do that, all we need to do is type in git commit dash dash amend okay go ahead and press enter it's going to go ahead and pop open this again and we just need to type in whatever we want we can just add the domain name to the git message and now we save it and now if we type in git log you can see that last git message has been changed now if we want to go back multiple commits all we need to do is type in git commit or actually not git commit, git rebase dash i. Dash i is for interactive, okay? And then we're gonna type in head, and then the tilde sign, and then the amount of commits we wanna go back. I'm just gonna go back two commits, okay? And see right here, it says pick. Well, we have all these options down here. Pick, reword, edit, squash, fix up, exec, drop. We're just gonna focus on the reword option in this video. So we're gonna type in reword, for both of these, okay? And now, it's gonna let us change both of these commit messages, okay? And we'll just put for a second time, because we're adding this commit for a second time. And now if we do git log, you can see added bash script to host.promo for a second time, added dot git ignore file to host.promo. Before we didn't have this, and before we didn't have this, okay? So that is how you change git commit messages. And if you already have a repository you push to, you could just do git push f. What the dash f does is it's a force push, okay? But be very careful using this. If you have a big team or you have an open source project, people may have already downloaded the old repository, okay? So use this very caution, cautiously, okay? And if you have any questions or anything, leave them down below and make sure to like, make sure to comment and make sure to subscribe and make sure to check out host.promo. There's a bunch of free trials for cloud hosting going on and free domain offers on there, okay? And thank you very much for watching. Peace out.